Hi guys, Kevin here, welcome back to Pocket Psychology. Do you have those nights where you can't seem to switch off? Do you find yourself overthinking events from the day? Does your body feel exhausted but your mind just won't allow you to sleep? Let's face it, who hasn't had periods in their life like this? In this video we are going to share with you the one thing that's been proven to help you detox your mind, so you can get the relaxation you deserve. Research has shown that journaling before bedtime helped people fall asleep more quickly and reduced bedtime worrying. Additionally, they slept a lot longer than those who didn't journal before bed. The benefits of journaling before bed are incredible. You can see the journal as your personal counselor, let your deepest worries, difficult emotions or darkest thoughts out onto paper. Just writing whatever is on your mind can be soothing. Regular journaling can help you manage anxiety and stress as well as cope with depression because it enables you to prioritize your issues and fears, comprehend your triggers, and more clearly see any patterns you may have. The benefits of journaling for mental health are quite remarkable. The case for journaling before bed is strong because of these general advantages as well as the emotional release that comes from expressing your thoughts and feelings at the end of the day. You can get better sleep by journaling before bed. You might discover that you fall asleep more quickly when your head strikes the pillow if you write down a to-do list, clear your head of unresolved ideas, or discuss difficult situations from the day. Writing down specifics from the day, you can write about your feelings, too. May help maintain your memory over time. Studies also show that journaling improves your memory in general. There is no better time than right before bed to jot down thoughts and reflect on the day. You'll be able to recall minute details that could be forgotten by the next morning because your memories of the day will still be vivid. Journaling can replace a bad habit you have around bedtime, for example scrolling through social media, which has been proven to disrupt circadian rhythms and healthy sleep patterns. According to studies on the formation and breakdown of habits, it is best to switch out a bad habit with a new one when trying to break one. For instance, you might want to try going for a walk after supper every night if you always crave sugar afterward. Journaling before bed can be a great habit-changing tool if you often engage in pre-bedtime activities that either interfere with your sleep or just set a terrible mood for the end of the day, such as watching Netflix. There is no best way to journal for better sleep. Any type of journaling is preferable to none at all. Having said that, research on how journaling affects sleep discovered that making a to-do list before bed appears to lead to better overall sleep. If you find that stream of consciousness journaling or diary writing benefits you more, or simply comes more naturally to you, that's also an excellent pre-bedtime journaling style that will help you get better sleep. Thanks for watching guys, go journal and have a great sleep afterwards.